Okay, everybody, welcome back to Willie's Copper Kitchen, and I'm going to be making Jello salad. And this Jello salad here is orange Jello salad, and the ingredients I'm going to be using, I'm going to be using a large curd cottage cheese, and you really want to make sure you drain that. And you're going to be using two of them. Okay. Now, I'm saying large curd, and I know a lot of people say they don't like to heat it, but if you're using it in this particular recipe, you need the large curd because it's going to be a lot of stirring, and it'll be small curd by the time we're done. So that was two large curds of cottage cheese. I've already pre-drained two cans of Dole mandarin oranges. You can use whatever type of Cool Whip that you like to. I'm using whip topping, great value. It really don't matter what particular kind you use on this, on this particular recipe. And we're gonna be using one large box and one small box of orange Jello gelatin. And I would recommend buying Jello brand. It's a nice Jello. So now I'm gonna go ahead and take my uh, cottage cheese, and I'm going to pour it into the bowl. I'm going to shake it, make sure it drains, and it wasn't very juicy, so yay. Okay. And now I'm going to take my mandarin oranges, and I'm going to pour them into the cottage cheese. And I'm going to go ahead and stir them in there. Now, there's a lot of different Jello salads out there. This is a little bit different than most because most people put marshmallows in their Jello salad. But I do not enjoy a cold marshmallow. And when the Jello salad gets cold, it makes your Jello salad slimy, I think. So now the next step I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and put half of my gelatin in there. I'm gonna stir that around for a second also. Well, oh, this does smell good. <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna add half my Cool Whip, or great value, whip topping. I'm gonna add half of that. I'm gonna stir that in there really good. So now I just added the rest and the end of the gelatin, orange yellow gelatin. Now you can see how that second cup that I added, how it instantly almost changed the color of that to a darker orange. And that's what you want. Now I'm going to go ahead and add the rest of this with topping. Mmm, that smells good. <laughs> Now this recipe here, I remember, uh, I've seen it, I've seen it all over the internet, but this particular dish right here, I remember when I was a boy, my grandmother used to make this all the time. And without giving out my age, that's just, this recipe is at least over 40 years old. And if you wanted to make a different type of gelatin, jello salad, you could use lime gelatin, you could use strawberries, you could put strawberries in here and use strawberry gelatin. And I have done that to all of them. I just don't add the marshmallows because like I said, I don't like cold marshmallows. Okay, so you really want to stir this really good. You want to get that whipped topping in there and you do not want no granulates of that orange yellow in there. And look at that. If you needed a quick something to make and you were invited to dinner to someone's dinner at the last moment or someone needed a carry-in dish real quick right there you have it what you call a five minute dish and it's worth the time and it's worth the money because it tastes delicious okay everybody so there you have it i showed you how to make orange jello salad
And I also want to remind you to hit the like and subscribe button and help me grow my channel. Until next time.